Hello, everyone. Hope you're all doing well. I hope by now many of you are comfortable with being conscious of your reality shifting all around you. Today we're covering Noxema, for voting video number 127. I always remember Noxema as N-O-X-E-M-A. Well, apparently in this reality, it's always had a Z. <laughs> Nox, Noxzema. That's right, always a Z after the X. So I'm going to be showing you here what's really amazing about this here, this video, you know, someone cared enough, 2009, which is a very interesting year, you're going to find out here in just a minute in Google Trends. They care enough to put the commercial up, but they can't spell Noxema right for this reality. Now you go, it's like the people didn't get the memo. The same on the commissary lists I'm going to show you from the prisons, from some different prisons, government commissary lists. It's like they didn't get the memo. So people commenting, NOX, CMA. Uh, there's a few different people commenting with, with the spelling that I recall. Please sum this up if you recall NOX, CMA. Go ahead and thumb down the video if it's always been... N-O-X-Z-E-M-A, like this. It's what it's always been, 50 years. So like so many times we've seen before, something happened in 2009. You can't tell me all of a sudden people just learned how to spell Noxema in 2009. There were, there were some points back here in two... Really? You have more than twice as many people searching for the wrong spelling back in 2006? There was almost always people more people searching for Noxema, N-O-X-E-M-A, than the correct N-O-X-Z-E-M-A until 2009. Then everyone learned how to spell. This is bizarre. How can you look at this and not say something happened here? Now, is this, uh, you know, does CERN have some big update here or something? I don't know. This makes me wonder what's going on see i've never ruled out cern and stuff like that i mean i think this is a natural thing that's happening with the consciousness with the collective consciousness and it's so obvious there's something gone on I mean, if there's nothing going on then please all the people who aren't experiencing this phenomenon or the ones who think it's all bs explain this Break this down right here. What happened? How did everyone learn how to spell it all of a sudden? We see this with a lot of effects. 2009. I've seen this so many times right here. So, let's see. Uh, you got, this is spelled correctly here. Here's someone commenting nine months ago. N-O-X-E-M-A with the wrong spelling. 1984, NOX, CMA, skin cream, commercial, put up two years, uh, yeah, gonna be three years ago, man, time's just flying on, flying on by, NOX, ZEMA, right there in the commercial, I used Noxema back in the day when I was a teenager, and then my 20s, and I was chasing the ladies, wanted to have that nice, clean face, <laughs> so, uh, let's see, yeah, I mean, you look through, so many people remember NOX, EMA, all these YouTube videos. Now, a lot of times people point out, oh, well, there's only 2,000 YouTube videos with the incorrect spelling, and there's 100,000 with those correct spelling. Well, you look at this, there's 6,000 results for the incorrect spelling, and there's only 9,800 for the correct spelling. So there's not a whole lot more YouTube videos with the correct spelling it's been for the last 50 years. I mean, this is, we got 3,700 books with N-O-X-E-M-A. I mean, this one here is clear Mandela effect for myself. Maybe it's not for you. Maybe it's always been N-O-X-Z-E-M-A for you, and that's fine. You can go ahead and comment and say it's always been N-O-X-Z-E-M-A for me, meaning for yourself, but don't try and go saying, oh, it's always been N-O-X-Z-E-M-A for everybody. No, that's not how this works. So many people are confused. They don't understand that 
Different people are seeing different things at different times. That's what we're learning with all this. Here's on Twitter. Hashtag N-O-X-E-M-A. Tons of people remember Noxema. Here it is here. Hashtag N-O-X-E-M-A. And here it is the correct spelling. Always. N-O-X-Z-E-M-A. It's just, this is foreign. I've never seen this. I used this product before, but this I've never seen before. The Z just throws it all off. Totally. So I'll leave you with this information here. We have some, uh, here's a school kill again. This came up before, I think with Vaseline. I had over 100,000 views on my Vaseline video for some reason. Uh, one of these, you're going to see double Mandela, which I always like to find. So if we go down here to skin, let me zoom this in here a little bit. We find Vaseline, all right, and Noxema. This is this is what I would expect to find. This here looks like what I always remember: Noxema, N O X E M A, dollar ninety, five dollars and twenty cents for some Vaseline. Okay, so always Vaseline for me. In my video, tons of people remember Vaseline. You know, like baseline, like a baseline in a song, B-A-S-E-L-I-N-E. -E. Well, V-A-S-E-L-I-N-E -E, to me is baseline, but it's pronounced Vaseline. I understand that. But uh, just like gasoline, petroleum, Vaseline, always Vaseline. This was always been to me. I know now that it's always been baseline, but that's something new. That's one of the new things that I've learned with the Mandela effect. So here's another NOX EMA skin cream, commissary list. And here we have a FCI ferritin commissary ordering form. And we get down to here to the personal care items. And we're going to find Noxema. There it is, NOX EMA skin cream. There's at least 10 or 15 commissary lists with this spelling. It's like they didn't get the memo in 2009 and they still have it like this. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Crazy. <laughs> this one was kind of fun doing the research on. I like doing the, the music ones. I like searching the covers of people getting everything wrong because they're being Mandela affected. So that's about it. Please vote, comment. This is a pretty big one for me. The Noxzema with the Z just looks so bizarre to me. So, I'll be pretty busy this week. I'll try and put out a few videos. Go create the reality that you want. I really believe this is about raising our frequencies and our vibration. and Basically, this is a spiritual thing for me. Sometimes I feel like there's like there's a dark nefarious agenda behind it just with some of the changes are odd and weird and But I'm sticking with what I've always thought I could be wrong That's just what I've always thought Starting in 2011. I was calling my videos are up. I was calling for a coming shift in consciousness and humanity And we got it <laughs> boy did we get it and boy did it Knock me back and sit me on the couch for a few days when I first noticed the Mandela effect. It just blew me away. So this is what we have now. Once you get through the initial shock, if any of you are new to this, you know, it just becomes part of your life. But it doesn't go away. I know a bunch of channels that stopped what they were doing and just turned to the Mandela effect because this is such an incredible thing. I have people saying, oh, don't sweat the small stuff. Life's too short. Uh, reality changing all around me isn't the small stuff, okay? I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe it is for you, but it's not for me. It's pretty big. It's one of the biggest things that ever happened in human history, in my opinion. So, uh, that's about it. I will talk to everybody soon.